After two weeks of college football, does this team have a Heisman contender? Ole Miss? I'm going to say no. I know Ole Miss has some really talented players on their team. I just don't think they're going to get to like an 11-1 that you need for a Heisman contender. And TCU. TCU, I also kind of think the same thing. I know they have a lot of transfer guys and some good players there, but I just really don't see it. Same thing for Wisconsin. I feel bad. These are good teams. I just don't really see any Heisman contenders on there, but USC. I still think at this point, you have to consider Caleb Williams the favorite for the Heisman again. I know he just won last year, but I have a really good feeling he's going to go back to back, but Ohio State. After week one, I was a little worried about Marvin Harrison Jr., but he had a monster week in week two, and I still think he can get there. Boston College. Sadly for Boston College, I don't think anybody is going to get there in the next 20 years for them. Texas A&M. It's kind of crazy because Texas A&M has one of the five most talented rosters in all of college football, but I just don't think anybody's going to get there for them, but we're moving on to the Longhorns. Quinn Ewers has a Heisman signature victory over Alabama going in there and beating them and absolutely handling their defense, and if he continues on this trajectory, he's absolutely a Heisman contender. All right, let's do one more team to finish this video out. We got... Kansas. You know, I really do like Jalen Daniels out of Kansas, and I think he's an eccentric quarterback, but I just don't see him being a Heisman contender. Make sure to hit the follow button if you want more college football videos.